Point greetings, my fellow Lawn Darkin. Welcome back to the Lawn Dark. Yeah, we're in version 0.359 of the test build. So, warning, spoilers, spoilers, spoilers. If you don't want to check anything out before launch. Uh, they do have another fi hot fix incoming uh, with some more changes. I'm going to go over all the changes in 3.359 in a short little video here. Uh, one thing I also want to do, uh, give it away uh, four uh, Steam uh, copies of the Long Dark. Ah, uh, yeah, just uh, enemy comments, what about you love about the game, etc. Uh, comments below, and I will pick uh, four lucky winners, and we'll get to use the key. You're going to need to give me a uh, email address, though, because that's I've got the, I've got it actually in my uh, inventory on Steam, so I don't just have the Steam key. So, yeah, you're just going to have to shoot me an email, and then I will get you a copy out of that. So, yeah, just enter below. Give me some what you love about the game, uh, etc. Any kind of stories you've had if you want to get a, yourself a copy of the long dark on PC. Okay, yeah, changes in point three five nine. A little bit of a nerf. I, I'm at, I'm kind of at odds if I like this or not. Uh, some things made sense, some things didn't. They actually did tweak uh, the loot a bit. Uh, I one thing I've noticed because actually just started a new game. I uh, just took out the new update, and we're about uh, day seven. Yeah, about day seven. Yeah, there is a little bit more loot in uh, some uh, big bigger locations. And overall, I've noticed there's a, it's not like, still, it's pretty much bare bones. But there is more than I have uh, seen before. I mean, it's not terribly excessive. I kind of enjoyed going through a house and not finding a single thing, but, uh, to keep an eye on that. You're not, eh, I could do with that, but it's, it's, I guess they're giving you a little bit of a nicer, uh, touch there. Just want to go outside, I've got, actually got some gut and, uh, hide. I don't know if that's about finally cured. Probably lean more towards a snare first. I do have a hacksaw. Actually, we've got a little bit of... Yeah, we do have two. Yeah, we've actually got three deer hides now. I run around going, uh, getting deer carcasses. is uh, really something you want to do straight up in Interloper. Actually, we'll be starting a new volume of the Lawn Dark as well. Because that volume two early access thing has got way, way too big. So actually, we're starting a third volume. Uh, Interloper. That's what I call it. The Interloper. Uh, so we're going to be starting on that. Probably going to be playing a little bit more Lawn Dark than I have been uh, lately. I've been covering a lot of other stuff. We'll be still doing the Fallout 4 and everything. Uh, but we'll be getting uh, you more Lawn Dark. This is going to get an exciting again. Okay, well actually I might go make a snare. Even though it is uh, brutally cold. Yeah, it's brutally cold in the morning. Whew. I think they've added uh, four... Uh, Hammers to the game uh, in the maps, and we do we're just it's pretty much about, about one of very rare spawn. Now there are four, so more likely you're able to find them. I've actually uh, I spawned in Timberwolf Mountain. I uh, just came straight because it's it, it's doable. It it is doable in Timberwolf Mountain. Trap interloper. Just it's just a much easier time if you come down here. Take care. It's a little bit of a, it's a little bit of a job to get down here, but uh, it is a little bit nicer. Yeah, I think I've already gotten all this. So we're five degrees. We're a little warmer. Let us go get... Well, I can go do the old man beer wound dressing, too. That's probably a good idea to have. They also fixed the uh, bug with the uh, cargo containers. So you actually, the hacksaw, you can actually get those uh, now. But I do believe they did... Uh, but not quite as many up in the summit. Yeah, not quite as many up the summit. Okay, we're going to probably have... I'm going to have to probably be warm before we go looking for a, a snare spot. It's just way too cold. I knew a good one back behind, but I mean, it can't be too far away. Oof. I could get a fishing line also, but a fishing line... Uh, useful out here if I go to Penza Pond, but that's it. It's a little dangerous self. If I'm going to go back down to Coastal Highway. I've gone down to Coastal Highway uh, in this run. Just to just go around a little, checking out the loots and stuff. Clothing wise, eh, I don't think we're doing too great. But uh, until you get the crafted stuff. Uh, I also seen the sleeping uh, bed rolls. I actually do have some bed rolls in the game. Okay, cool. well, I gotta do some inventory management later here. Yeah, we're not too. Not so hot. We got a toque though. I mean, we got that going for us. Some work boots. They're about as good as it gets. Yeah, negative 24. Probably have to warm up before I even go attempt that. Yeah, so it is. It, it's about slightly, uh, oh, another big thing. 
Uh, forgot to mention earlier, uh, hacksaws could now. This this actually I do agree with this. Uh, it does actually make a logical sense. Uh, it does make logical sense. You can actually take down uh, saplings uh, and uh, limbs now with the hacksaw. Takes takes longer now though, a little bit longer uh, than normally if you use the hatchet, etc. Of course. But it is doable now, so you can actually get some firewood and get firewood, uh, get that bow going a lot quicker. You don't have to necessarily go out to the forge, uh, yeah, yeah, at all. If you want, as long as you keep that hacksaw repaired, uh, you can do that. It would be nice as long as there was a uh, forge, another forge, but I mean, not not required. It doesn't a lot of people can make more game sense? I mean, I just can't just pop a forge out in the middle of nowhere, of course. But let's see. I might, I might just actually warm up in the bed. Because I'm going to show you another thing. Uh, they did change this and then they kind of retracted it a little bit. But they did it in a nice style though. There was actually a nice fix on the fly. And also you can drop... Uh, it was kind of... I was I guess it was bugged earlier. You can redrop the water again on on the floor. Because I, I actually was playing on the, on the first version of test build. And drop the water on the floor. Like, oh, it's all gone. I'm like, no. It's horrible. My voice just cracked a little bit there. Yeah, so now you can actually pass time in the bed. It almost kind of illogically you know, didn't make a little bit of sense that you that you can't get warm under the covers. So they did put that back in. Yeah, nice little transition. So you can actually do that pretty well. Yeah, I'm on PC. I'm just playing with the Xbox controller because I'm a little lazy. I'm a little lazy. Okay. And as for the Steam Guide, I probably will be updating that near the end of the week. I'm just kind of waiting for this last hotfix because I've got most of it all written up. I just, yeah, don't have to rewrite everything if they do do a 360 or something, so. Yeah, I might actually get a little bit of sleep. And one of the keys to the interloper, you definitely got to keep track on your condition. You cannot let that go dip down too much. But, I said, once you get over the initial couple days, it's really not that bad. I've got a couple weeks uh, thus far. I haven't had, you know, more time than that to play. We did do that 26-hour marathon uh, over the weekend. Bunch of money for charity. And it is a blizzard. Oh, well, so I guess I'm not going anywhere for a bit. Yeah, blizzards are, uh, will become more prevalent. I probably have had one about once a day. But those are, I guess, due to increase. Along with wildlife scarcity, uh, resource scarcity, less limbs, etc. And we'll be getting colder over time. So I'm kind of interested to see. It's already, uh, just brutally cold every day. I... Negative 50, 100 below. I don't know. Just eventually, we can we can about make it without getting hyperthermia to any good. Uh, go over to the barn, etc. You can make it from the spot to spot that you need to, but uh, any colder than that, it's, it gets a little dicey. I guess we'll leave off here since I did get a blizzard interrupted. I'll continue my run long dark. So expect a lot of long dark next week, and I will cover the hot fix and everything. But the main thing to take out of this: uh, more hammers now. You can't sleep in beds. Uh, cargo containers are fixed. Uh, I can also use the uh, hacksaw now to get uh, saplings and uh, limbs. So, have a little bit. If you're trying out, you've had enough of stock, you want to try a little bit of the interloper. Yeah, they made it uh, well, quite a bit easier to get into, but it's still a little tougher than stocker, I would have to say. So, alright, I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more long dark content. And I will see you guys in the next video.